So we talked about it on our Courier podcast this week. There's 11 ranked teams in the NICL out of 17. Mm -hmm. Going up against that night in, night out, what's that grind been like for you guys? Uh, well, it's definitely tough, but I think it really just helps us to become a better team. Seeing that competition is really good for us and just really pushes us and is going to help us in that postseason play. Well, looking at it, I don't think you can create a greater collection of just high school volleyball talent mm -hmm. in terms of teams and individual players than what we have right here in Northeast yeah. Iowa. Talk a little bit about that from your perspective. Um, well, yeah, it's really fun seeing all these great players just playing volleyball against you know, Payton Pierce and Jaden Pearson, all those really good players, it's really just fun and helps you become a better volleyball player yourself. And it really just motivates you. And yeah, it's just a fun game. Playing specifically at DS during club, mm -hmm. how has that kind of helped your, your defensive game grow? Yeah, well, I would say I'm very like a defensive setter. I think that defense in the club like really helps me out to play defense in school for my team. So I'm not just focused on, you know, going to go get the second ball. I'm ready to play that first ball. And that really just helps our team on the defensive end. Well, you're pretty good playing the second ball. Yeah. Talk a little bit about what I, what you've been able to accomplish this year because you've led Grundy Center in assists every year. Talk about mm -hmm. what these last four years have, have been like for you. Um, yeah, I mean, it's been amazing. I've been setting these last four years. I think it's just Continually, I've been growing throughout the past four years and just kept getting better for my team, working on each practice, just getting 1% better for my team. I talk about the talent you're going up against, but you got a lot, you've been able to set to a lot of really great talent on yeah. your own team. Uh, talk a little bit about what it's been, been like to work with uh, Carly and, and some of the other hitters that have come out of the Center. Yeah, it's been awesome. Like, setting the ball and knowing that I have a hitter that will go up and do their best to attack the ball and get a kill. That's just really like supportive to me. So I know that there's someone on the other side that will give it their all to get the ball down. You guys ran into a really good Denver team in the regional final last mm -hmm. year. Felt just short of state. How bad do you want to make it back this year? So bad. I think we put it all together. And I think we lost by four points. And I think we just keep continuously remembering those four points. And it's just really pushing us to our goal of state at the end of the year and really giving us that motivation to get down there. Get, uh, if you're if you're fortunate enough, you're clearly talented enough. If you're fortunate enough to make it down to the Coral Delta Extreme Arena, uh, what, what's going to be able to cap off your high school career there going to mean to you? That would just be awesome. I mean, these last four years we haven't been able to make it down there, and I think just us all having the experience together that would just be amazing to end our high school season down there together against some great competition. And then, how do you just think this part of the state stacks up to the rest of the state? It's crazy. I mean. Obviously, you can see we have all these ranked teams. It's just so much competition just in this small little area, and it's awesome.